Leo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for stopping in with me. I hope everyone is doing well. So if you have a Leo placement anywhere in your chart, then there can possibly be a message here for you. Keep in mind, you guys, that this is a general energy reading, all right? Not a personal. So this may or may not resonate with you guys. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. Um, please do not try to make it fit if this is not your story. Um, I ask that you check out the other placements in your chart. Your messages could be there. All right, and cross watchers are welcome. All right, so Leo, what y'all got going on? Let's see. We're about to see what y'all got going on. Messages from spirit. All right, spirit, what messages? Listen and reflect. All right? Sometimes what a person needs is not a wise mind that speaks, but a patient heart that listens. So, spirit is saying someone here just really needs somebody to listen to them right now. Okay? Um, and a lot of times that's what people need. It's okay to give your feedback and your opinion and um, be able to tell a person how you view a situation. But sometimes it's also good just to be quiet and just hear a person out to hear exactly what it is that they have to say. Because a lot of times that's all a person wants. It's just for somebody to just listen to them. All right, so maybe that is what um, your person could be asking of you at this time, Leo, or maybe this is what you are asking of your person. Flip-flop the energies around, you know, y'all already know how this goes. All right, Spirit, messages for Leo, please. Messages for Leo. Messages for Leo, please. Safe place. There's nothing like being able to let your guard down and know that you are protected by your partner's love. So you guys feel like this is your safe place. You feel like your partner is, it's like home. You know this person well, this person knows you well. You could be around, um, you could be yourself around this person, all right? You feel like you can really trust this person with your heart. You know this person will, um, is not a judgmental person, so you can actually like really talk to this person. I'm getting like best friend vibes when it comes to your person that you are currently thinking about while you are watching this video. You guys feel like you can just really be your se your, yourself around this person. You're really comfortable around this person. You have vivid dreams. Pay attention to your dreams. As the connection deepens, your dreams become more pronounced and full of answers. So spirit could be showing you a lot of things that you may be questioning right now when it comes to this connection between you and your person. The answers may be coming to you through your dreams. So pay close attention to the dreams that you are having or are going to be having. We have breakup. Time apart is on the horizon. This may be short term or long term. So there's a breakup that's getting ready to happen. This can be um, in between you and your person or this can be with someone else, but we'll see. And we have annoyance. You or your partner may be annoyed right now. 
give each other space to cool off and avoid more arguments, to avoid more arguments. Yeah. This could be a whole nother situation with the annoyance and the breakup. But we're gonna see Sweet song at the bottom of the deck. Soulmates often use music and songs as a telepathic aid in order to share spiritual messages and emotions with each other. So you guys can be getting or hearing a lot of songs that remind you of your person. Your person can be getting, hearing a lot of songs that is reminding them of you. Um, so pay close attention to the music that you're hearing. When you in your car or you at home listening to the radio, certain songs may come on, all right? And this is your person communicating with you, all right? So we have the world card. There's a cycle here that is being closed out so there can be a new beginning, all right? So ending and new beginning energy here. Spirit, what messages do we have? The Leo, the Magician. A lot of you guys have manifested this, all right? You guys have manifested this person, this connection. The Knight of Cups. So they're coming in with some type of proposal, some type of romantic gesture, all right? There can be a lot of challenges with the Seven of Swords right now. But I feel like this person is your person is definitely getting up the courage and going to be putting in the effort despite all of the challenges that you two are currently going through right now. I feel like your person is going to show up and actually put the effort in. All right, y'all. So I don't know what to do about this right now with this light situation because I don't know but just bear with me y'all alright spirit let's see what is the world clarify this world energy please spirit yeah new beginnings so there's definitely you guys are getting ready to experience a real true love situation. Um, the type of romance that you have been manifesting in your life is getting ready to come to you. If you guys are in separation from your person or you guys are really, you know, maybe you're talking to this person but things are kind of on the up and up right now things are still in the air it's because this person has to complete and close out a cycle before you guys can have this new beginning and i feel like they're going to do just that that's why we have the breakup here six of pentacles finding that balance that is needed so that you guys can come together, all right? Emperor, divine masculine energy. And with the emperor, I'm getting, this is someone that is very stable, has a lot of order in their life. This can be somebody that's very powerful, entrepreneur, business um, 
They can have their own business. And this person is definitely a protector. And that's why you guys also feel safe when you are with this person. It's like you don't have any fears at all when you are with them. Hmm. Spirit, tell me about the Knight of Cups. What is this Knight of Cups? The moon. So, your person could be coming in to reveal something to you. Something that could have been hidden from you. Maybe getting ready to be revealed. Or maybe this is your person. If, Like I said, if there's another situation, um, there is another situation that needs to be closed out here. So this can be your person revealing this to whomever it is that they are dealing with. They may have a lot of fear in doing this. But with the Seven of Wands, I feel like this person is getting up the courage to make this move. We have the Strength card. That's your card, Leo, your energy. Yeah, it's going to take a lot of inner strength for you to be able to get through this situation or for your person to be able to get through this situation. Spirit, tell me about um, what is this moon energy with the Knight of Cups? The Six of Cups. Reconciling, reminiscing. Past, um, past life connection or going back to reconciling with someone from your past. This is what they have to tell someone. All right? Two of cups, falling in love, coming into union, wanting a second chance. So I feel like they have to reveal all of this information to whomever this person is and that's where the challenge is. That's where the challenge is closing out a cycle to be able to come into union and reconcile with you. That's a challenge for this person. Hmm. We got the Knight of Swords here. It's a very ambitious energy very action oriented somebody has a lot on their minds and i feel like they are coming in to speak some type of truth and clarity to someone the page of wands there's that message all right so there's going to be a message here that is going to, um, this is good news. All right. Can have something to do with this queen of pentacles. Tell me about this queen of pentacles with the page of wands, spirit. Tell me about this queen of pentacles with the page of wands. Somebody is trying to keep quiet. This queen of pentacles could be trying to keep, keep quiet. Maybe when they receive this message, all right, with the page of wands, 
it's like this person doesn't want any type of drama. They don't want to argue. They do not want to fight. We got the Three of Pentacles here. This speaks about teamwork and planning. Mm. What else, please, Spirit? There can be an argument a fight or some type of disagreement that's going to happen with the five of wands energy and this queen of pentacles with this message all right whenever they get this message that your person is going to be sending to them um and letting them know i feel like your person has to let this person know that they are in love with you um, they are reconciling with you and that they are going to give this a second chance. That's going to cause some problems with this other person that they are dealing with. It can turn into an argument. It can turn into a fight. It could be one of those things where they feel like, I thought that we was a team. I thought we had plans. I thought that we were going to build together. And that's why we have the breakup here with the annoyance. Six of Swords, moving on to calmer waters. Somebody doesn't want to deal with these lies, this hidden dishonor. So somebody is running away from this situation because now somebody is feeling hurt. Somebody feels like they have been lied to. They are feeling like, you know, the plans that they had with your person has now been torn right from up under them. We have the Hermit, Virgo energy. There could be some distance between you and your person during this time because they're doing a lot of soul searching an introspection. They're really trying to figure some things out. Maybe this was not an easy situation for them to, an easy cycle for them to close out, but it was needed to be done in order for you two to be able to have this new beginning with this Ace of Cups over here and for them to be able to give to you equally four swords, something had to be put to rest. What else here for Leo, please, Spirit? We got the Six of Wands. Mm. Success and victory. Triumph. Overcoming obstacles. All right. So I feel like the both of you are, yes, definitely going to um, overcome the obstacles and challenges that were in the way for you all to be able to come together and into union, the chariot, finding the willpower to move forward. And we have two cards here that speak of triumph, the chariot and the six of wands. So things can be moving forward successfully for you and your person um, after they close out this cycle. What else, Spirit, for Leo? The Eight of Swords. Somebody is in their head. They feel powerless. They feel confused about this fresh start. Somebody may feel like they have lost control over a situation. Hmm.
We got the two of wands energy. There could be something that is influencing this person's decisions. All right. Give me two more messages for Leo, please, Spirit. The King of Swords. This person is very smart. All right. Um, The King of Swords is somebody who is very intellectual. They could be receiving some type of wise counsel from someone that they are very close from. I mean, close to at this time as well. The Nine of Pentacles. This person is very disciplined as well and very abundant. Like, I don't know, somebody may feel like maybe they'll be better off just being single, okay? Trying to find some type of balance with the, temp with the temperance card. Speaks about harmony, balance, and reconciliation. This nine of pentacles energy can also be you, Leo, like, you are definitely um, very independent, okay? And that's how this person could be viewing you as somebody who is very independent. You got everything together. You got all your ducks in a row. Like you're well off financially, you can take care of yourself. You got the king of cups energy. Y'all see this? Sorry, I'm trying to turn that light on. So you can be dealing with the water sign. This person is in love with you, though. And things are, with the will of fortune, things are going to turn out in your favor. Because this is your destiny. This is fated to happen for you. It's major turning points that are getting ready to happen in this connection. But somebody's going to be hurt when they receive this message. Ten of Swords. That's an ending. They're going to get all of the insight that they need. And there's that new beginning. The Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this person is make, going to be making a lot of sacrifices to be with you. I do. All right, Leo, so this is the message that I have for you. I hope everything, I hope this message resonated. I'm sorry, you guys, I'm, I am so tired. I hope this message resonated with you. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel if you already are not subscribed. If you guys need me for a personal reading, I am open. The information is down below in the description box. Until next time, I love you guys. Bye.